stock market crash, economy crash, big bad things happening, the jobs market doesn't look good, the economic data is coming out, we're gonna be in a recession, blah, 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 crypto's down, life savings, it's a, look, it's all buzzwords from the people on Twitter and social media and uh, the, the propaganda, the fear propaganda that's pushed if you're watching the news, okay? Stock crashes and economy crashes are good for people like you and me. When I say people like you and me, I mean go-getters, people that are kind of about it, people that have the personal agency to go and make their own decisions and succeed on their own in life. And they don't need mommy and daddy, big government to prop them up and tell them what to do, okay? Things like this are good. And I'll tell you, I'll tell you exactly why. Let's go back to the crash of 2020, March 2020, when the whole corona thing uh, came out. We all knew a lot of the lockdown stuff was complete bullshit, all of that, but the stock market crashed. Of course, it was massive fear-based news. It crashed massively. Bitcoin crashed. Bitcoin went from 6K to 3K, okay? And what do you think all the richest people in the world did? They bought the bottom. Why? Because what happened right after is lower interest rates, and printing of money by the Federal Reserve and this government and all the central banks throughout the world. And what followed was inflation, but really easy money. I remember I was a couple of years in the business and April through like September, 2020 was one of the best times in business for, for me. Um, and that was really where like I started to take off. And then the summer of 2021 after that was also very, very big. I ended up moving to Miami made a bunch of connections, just kept growing the business, um, hit my first six figure month. All that happened during the money printing inflationary period after they, they printed all the money and lowered the rates. It was good for business. The online space boomed. Guess what happened to e-commerce? Guess what happened to social media? It just got bigger. It grew massively. I don't, I'm not gonna give you the numbers right now. I don't have them pulled up. Go look it up. Go look up how much Amazon grew and Shopify grew and all these e-com stores and online purchases. Look up how big it grew. It didn't just grow because people are going online. That's one trend. It grew also because the money was printed and it was easy and they converged, okay? And so if you were in that space during that time, you made a shit ton of money. And if you're in that space now, you're still making it. Even if we're in a recession, you're still making a ton of money if you're doing it right and authentically and, and providing a good product or service in that space because it, it just, it's easier money, it's a trend, people are coming online, all that. And guess what happens when they print again, okay? And I think they're gonna print again. This is why I think economy crashes and stock crashes are good for us right now. For the system to keep going, you might be looking at me like, who's this online business guy? Look, I studied economics, I've studied economics for the past like seven years, okay? In, in school for a little bit and then mostly out of school because I dropped out of college after two months. Um, but I was there for that. And, you know, I believe that this system to, for it to go on, for them to continue this current system, they have to print money. And we are a long way away from that money printing being done. If the money doesn't keep getting printed, the system dies. Don't think they're gonna let that happen right now. And so if you have new presidential candidates, calling for print more money and weaker dollar and lower interest rates and all that stuff. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. And when that happens, not only will the asset prices go way, way up, just like they did after the crash. Look, after every crash, after 2008, after 2020, after the 2000s, after you know the Great Depression, and after this stock market crash or economy crash, whatever, it's going to go up and it's going to go up way, way, way higher. And look what happened after 2020. It went way up because they started printing, they pumped the liquidity into the economy and things just started moving. There was money flying everywhere. And when there's money flying everywhere, you want to get wet. And the best way to get wet is to own the products, own the services, own the goods that are being sold. And if you're an online business owner or you, you know, you're doing your personal brand, you're doing a faceless page like I do, or you do e-com, something along those lines, you will absolutely crush it if one, you're positioned ahead of time and good at what you do. And two, you just have a little bit of patience for the money printers to turn back on. And even if they don't turn back on, let's say they don't, you still built an online business and you're taking advantage of probably the fastest growing trend, which is that this isn't going away. People are coming on, you know, I made a video about iPad kids, okay? 
everybody's coming online. Parents are putting iPads and phones and all that in front of their kids at two years old. Those kids are never gonna get off those devices. Those are gonna be adults in 10, 20 years, and they're gonna be spending 10, 12 hours a day glued to the screen, glued to the screen, okay? Now, that trend of online business and making money online and, and like selling goods and services online, it's only gonna, it's only gonna increase. I would say right now the world is like 50% in person, 50% online. I think we're skewing towards, like the momentum is building towards online. Obviously the crash sped it up in 2020 and everything I just described, but it's gonna get crazier, especially when the easy money is out there. And so if you want some of the easy money, you should be a business owner. And if you already are a business owner, get ready, get prepared, get positioned, stop being lazy, understand that this is an opportunity of a lifetime. There are people that legitimately went from like a couple million bucks, you know, like doing pretty good to like hundreds of millions of dollars from like 2020 to 2022, hundred percent. I personally was just getting started in my business journey. So I went from a little bit of money to like, oh, I'm making millions of dollars. I believe that this leg up and when they start printing money and I, the vehicle that I'm in can allow me to go from a couple million to hundreds of millions, 100%, because the money is going to be acceleratingly easy. And that doesn't really make sense. But what I mean by acceleratingly easy is like, you think the pump last time was huge and the inflation last time was huge? Guess what happens when they do it again? Because everything's breaking, so they have to pump money in there to grease the system to make it work and keep it going. And so if you're somebody that has a little bit of wherewithal, you have a little bit of like, mm, and, and you know, pep in your step, um, you just have some energy about you and, and like you're an independent person with independent thinking that isn't afraid to go and get it, you can absolutely crush it. You can absolutely crush it in these next three years if you're positioned with the right online business, okay? And you realize what's in front of you and you don't get lazy and you stick head in the game locked in. Look guys, this is gonna be, this is gonna be crazy. I've been waiting for this, like I said, I've been waiting for this. It's gonna be crazy. This is like generational wealth building type of opportunity. Stock market crashes are good for people like you and me that can go and get it. And if you guys want help building your own online business, your personal brand, let's say you're good at something already, you wanna build a personal brand around it, or you just wanna make money on social media, you wanna take advantage in the next couple of years, I can help. Go down below, submit an application, you can work with me, you can get some more information on what we do, how we help people, how we grow social media brands, both personal brands and faces pages. But guys, I will see you in the next video.